Hey guys, to me from Malaysia, Vape Addict, the block spot com. A new review for you guys, and today I'm gonna review the Nimbus Clone version three. Okay, um, there's a lot of versions for the Nimbus Clone, but this is the Nimbus Clone version three. Okay, um, I'm not really sure what the difference are, but well, this is the version three I got. Um, there's a few difference I think I just remembered. Okay, so this is the Nimbus Clone. Okay, you guys know the Nimbus is very very famous. Uh, one of the most famous. Uh, RDA out there, okay, a rebuild, rebuildable dripping atomizers. Um, the Nimbus clone has a lot of versions of clone because it has been cloned without a logo and cloned with a logo but with one air hole and now it's cloned with two air holes. And uh, the version 3, I think, is the difference between the version 3 is because it has a screw heads, okay, instead of um, Allen key, okay. Uh, the, the few clones previously was Allen key uh, heads. But this one is a screw head, okay? So this is the Nimbus. It has a Nimbus logo, which is barely, barely noticeable, okay? Um, it's made by the JPGE, okay? I'm not sure who, but it's from the Philippines. But this is it's a clone, okay? So it's from China. Um, it doesn't come with a drip tape. It comes with a drip tape, but it's like a stock drip tape. I'm not sure where the drip tape is, but this is the Nimbus clone, okay? Uh, <clears throat> the body, the design is very nice, actually on my Chiyu clone, okay, it looks absolutely gorgeous, okay, um, and yeah, let's take it out and show you how it looks inside, okay, um, it's very, very tight, okay, the O-rings are like super tight, which is in a way good, okay, you guys can see that, three poles, okay, screw heads, I have a dual coil, it has a drip well too, okay, uh, you guys can pretty much see that, <laughs> You can hold quite a lot, a lot of e-liquid in there, okay? And you can set dual coil easily because it has three poles, okay? Uh, two wraps on these two poles and another wrap on these two poles, okay? So it's very easy to set dual coils. Comes with two air holes, okay? One, two. Um, it's a one, one point two millimeter air hole, maybe. I'm not sure, okay? I don't know how to uh, see it, but once you fire it, okay? It fires pretty well, okay. Um, the battery is not that strong now, but whatever, it still works fine, okay. So you have to line up the air hole together with your rig, okay. Line it up perfectly. Um, one thing I don't like about it, it doesn't go all the way down, okay. Um, it's my OCD kind of thing. I like it all the way down, but it's hard to push it all the way down, so I'm not gonna care about it. But yeah, this is the Nimbus clone, okay. Uh, it has a serial number too, if I can get the atomizer out which is <laughs> it's the Chi Yu clone you know you have to unscrew the atomizer so you can see unscrew the atomizer out yep it has a serial number okay I don't know why um, clones have serial number but it has okay it's a DV2661 uh, okay it's from Da Vapes okay Da DA Vapes they make like the Trident clone the Nimbus clone, they make they are making like a lot of clones, okay. Um but it's still very, very good, okay. The price is very good. It's like I bought it for like fifty ringgit, okay. So it's a pretty pretty nice price mod, okay. Um very, very nice price actually. Um <clears throat> but <clears throat> of course um I don't uh if you guys have the money do like support the original one, but if you guys want to try it out then yeah, just use the the clone one, okay. Um, I'm pretty happy with the clone one, but I'm definitely getting the original one because I'm really liking how it looks, and how it feels. Okay, the original one has a spit back uh, feature, which uh, does not allow juice to come out when you vape it. But this one does not have it; it's just empty. Okay, so there's nothing much to talk about there. And and let's see how it vapes. Okay. Very very nice vapor production. Okay, um, it all depends on your coil. Okay, so uh, I cannot say much about that. Um, if you guys uh, want good vapor production, you guys need to use du dual coils, but then you cut off the flavor. If you guys use single coil, then you guys will have more flavor but less vapor. Okay, I personally usually set this up with a single coil, but this one is on dual coil. I'm using some rib ribbon wire from Sweden. I'm gonna do a review for that soon, but it's a very very nice. Uh, Tripper, okay, it's like one of my favorite drippers of all time, okay, it just feels good, okay, stainless steel, um, very, very nice, I dropped it a couple times, no damage, no nothing, so, very, very nice, okay, let's have a last bait.
very, very nice flavor. Okay, you can drill the air holes, okay? The vapor production is not crazy amount because I don't have like <clears throat> big air holes, okay? It's not two millimeters, it's like one point something millimeter, okay? And yeah, hope you like my review. Um new hair. This is my room, okay, for you guys who's wondering why it's the change of background. This is my room, okay, not my new room, but this is my room in my hometown, okay? So for you guys who are wondering, yep, this is my room my room in my hometown. New hair guys. <laughs> Go to my vlog for in depth review. Um, where to get this? I almost forgot. Okay, www.facebook.com slash Ringo Bingo 2. Okay, he sells this. He sells like the Trident and also um, the Fatty clone, I think. I'm, don't, I'm not sure, but he sells quite a lot of the Dripper clones. Okay, so yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Go to my blog for in depth review. Peace out.